Welcome to Infigyan friends in this very very exciting video of algebraic challenging equations here we are going to solve one very interesting problem from SMO 2012 one quartic equation x power 4 minus 18 x cube plus k x square plus 200 x equal to 19 184 is given to us the product of two of the four roots of this quartic equation is minus 32 we have to find out the coefficient of x square that is k. So let's get started by considering one quartic equation, the general form. I am coming to the Vita's method. Ax power 4 plus bx cube plus cx square plus dx plus e equal to 0. And this equation's root, if I will consider p, q, r and s are roots then I can generate four formulas so first formula the sum of roots taken one at a time this is minus b over a the coefficient of x cube over the coefficient of x power 4 with minus sign second formula that is the product of root taken two at a time p q plus qr plus rs plus ps or sp this formula will be c over a third taken three at a time so i will write pqr plus pqs plus prs plus qrs equal to minus d over a so it is with minus sign and last formula the product of roots so p q r s this is e over a okay this is general formula using vita's theorem or method let us come to our our problem the quartic equation i am considering here a b c d are the roots so i will consider a b c d are the roots of this quartic equation so i will frame again equation let me write equation number one a plus b plus c plus d the sum of roots it is equal to minus 18 over 1 minus of minus 18 over 1 so that value will be 18 equation number two let's consider the product of roots taken two at a time or sum of the roots taken two at a time let me write AB plus BC plus CD plus AC plus AD plus BD equal to K. The sum of roots taken two at a time. Now sum of the roots taken three at a time. So I will write ABC plus ABD plus ACD plus BCD. This value is minus 200 as per our formula. Okay, see, it is, formula is minus d over a. And last equation I can frame that is the product of all the roots. So, a, b, c, d. This value is equal to minus 1984. Now, what is given to us minus 32? So, that is the product of any two roots. So let me consider the first two a and b. So ab is equal to minus 32. This value is given to us. So I can find out using equation 4. So you can write using equation 4. I will put this value. So abcd is equal to minus 1984. Put in place of ab I will write minus 32 times cd equal to minus 1984 so once you will divide you will get cd is equal to 62 so again we are having the product of two roots so any two roots minus 32 the remaining two 62 now i will use equation number three let me write equation three equation three is ABC 
प्लस ए बी डी प्लस ए सी डी प्लस बी सी डी दिस वैल्यू इज माइनस टू हंड्रेड दिस इज अवर इक्वेशन नंबर थ्री नाउ आई विल टेक ए बी कॉमन फ्रॉम द फर्स्ट टू टर्म्स सो इफ यू विल टेक ए बी कॉमन देन इन ब्रैकेट इट वुड बी सी प्लस डी एंड लास्ट टू टर्म्स इफ यू विल कंसिडर वट वट टर्म इज कॉमन ओवर देर इफ आई विल टेक सी डी कॉमन देन आई विल गेट अगेन लेट मी राइट सी डी कॉमन आई विल गेट ए प्लस बी इक्वल टू माइनस टू हंड्रेड ओके सो इन प्लेस ऑफ ए बी आई विल पुट द वैल्यू ऑफ ए बी ए बी वॉज माइनस थर्टी टू सो आई विल राइट माइनस थर्टी टू टाइम्स सी प्लस डी प्लस सी डी वैल्यू वॉज सिक्सटी टू सो आई विल पुट सिक्सटी टू ए प्लस बी equal to minus 200 now let's write the first equation now th that equation is required so first equation was let me write here equation 1 it was the sum of all the roots so a plus b plus c plus d that value was 18 now you can see two equations two unknown a plus b first unknown let me call this a plus b as m and c plus d as n so i can write my equation set i will write 62m minus 32n equal to minus 200 and see this equation i can write m plus n equal to 18 so two equations two unknown m and n if i will multiply this second equation with 32 and add with the first one this one then i will get m value so after simplifying or after solving the simultaneous equation we can conclude that m will come out 4 and n will come out 14 4 plus 14 is equal to 18 from the equation number 1 now m and n are known so what i will do now simply put the well let me write here m is equal to a plus b and that value is 4 and n is equal to c plus d and this value is 14 okay now i will put this value in equation number 2 so what is equation number 2 the sum of roots taken two at a time so let me write equation 2 so that equation was ab plus bc plus cd plus ac plus ad plus bd sum of roots taken two at a time bd it is equal to k now in place of ab we will put minus 32 let me write here and in place of cd we will put 62 okay let's write the remaining terms so bc this one plus ac plus ad plus bd equal to k so i can see if i will take c common from here so i will get a plus b or b plus a and d common from here then i will again get a plus b equal to k and c 62 minus 32 so 30 okay now if i will put the value of c a plus b is common first i will take a plus b out so it will be 30 plus a plus b Times c plus d equal to k. Thirty plus a plus b. If I will take common, then in bracket it would be c plus d equal to k. Now we know that a plus b is m value, that is four, and c plus d is n value, that is fourteen. Let's put over there thirty plus four. Times fourteen equal to k. So if I will take the product of four and fourteen, I will get fourteen times four is fifty six. Fifty six plus thirty is equal to eighty six. So our value of k is eighty six. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck.